And happening today, the Monterey Conference Center hosting its first public performance after a renovation, uh, renovation project closed the facility for two years. And just in time to what's becoming a holiday tradition here on the peninsula. Action News reporter Sierra Starch joins us live from Monterey with more. Yeah, good evening, Christopher. So Monterey is about one of 300 cities that host the tuba Christmas concerts. Now, we saw musicians come from as far as Reno and Long Beach to perform today. Now, they met this morning to rehearse, if you can believe it, and then it was time to put on the show. Brass instruments and brave volunteers. This is my first year on the tuba. More than 50 of them signed up this year for Tuba Christmas Monterey. Yeah, I'm very nervous. Yeah. Why? Because there's a lot of people. I feel like we're going to mess up. It's an annual concert of carols where the tubists get to shine. They're also only typically one or two in any orchestra. So anytime they get to be with a whole bunch of their own tribe, they light up and they just have a phenomenal time. Tune after tune, the tubas stole the show. Once you hear your Christmas favorites with tubas, you'll never feel like you can hum that same carol again because it is so beautiful. Those brave volunteers and their brass instruments bringing Yuletide cheer to their biggest audience to date. Now speaking of the, their big audience, the conference center really gave them a lot more room to grow into what a big tradition this is becoming. Now they performed in front of about 1,000 people today, Christopher. Well, that's a good welcome back for the conference center. Thank you, Sierra. The tuba Christmas tradition dates back to 1974 when late master tubist Harvey Phillips invited his fellow musicians to play with him at the rink at Rockefeller Center.